Hi guys, Rachie Bop here. Welcome back to part two of the Sims Free Play Easter 2016 quest walkthrough. Thank you to EA and Fire Monkeys who have provided me with this early access beta. So we've left it 24 hours and now we can continue with today's part of the chocolate egg chase quest. The first task here is to check on Cottontail. After getting excited about his egg hunter challenge, Cottontail finally stopped running around and looked slow. Have a sim ask Cottontail if he's okay. And now that's done, the next part of the quest is to research bunny food. Cottontail says he feels hungry and needs bunny food. Your sim has no idea what to feed bunnies though. Have a sim research bunny food on a computer. So we're going to go ahead and research bunny food on her computer. And now she's done that. That was absolutely of no point because... Um, now we need to find a bologna sandwich. This is so random. The internet says rabbits eat lettuce and grass. But your sim has a feeling that won't work with Cottontail. He probably needs something more human. Have a sim find a bologna sandwich. I, I don't know if I'm saying that wrong. I can't say I've ever had a bologna sandwich in a refrigerator. So the first step of that part of the quest was to find it and the next part, like I said, is to give the bunny food. Your sim found a sandwich, thinks they should play along with Cottontail's imagination. Have a sim give the bunny food to Cottontail. So we're going to give him the bologna sandwich and he's totally going to believe that that's what rabbits eat. So just grab that plate from the back pocket. There we go. And there's your bologna sandwich, little bunny. So that part of the task is complete. The next part is to watch springtime shows. Cottontail is eating the bunny food and this may be a good time for your sim to relax. Have a sim watch springtime shows on a TV. So we're going to go ahead and click the TV and select springtime shows. And I have absolutely no idea what is springtime about fighter jet programs but anyway when that part of the task is done we are then offered the next part which is to search for eggs halfway through a show cottontail pokes your sim and looks impatient i bet you can't find three more eggs have up to three sims search for eggs on objects around a house you can also ask cottontail for help so at this point you can have more than one sim, so up to three sims searching for eggs at a time. So, so that will save you a lot of time because this is going to take four and a half hours to search each object and you don't always find eggs. Sometimes you do and then they will appear in your egg hunter's case. But other times you won't, you'll just find some simoleons, which is great, but it took four and a half hours. Like, who searches that long? Um, the amount of simoleons varies. It seems to vary between 20 and 25. But you can also ask Cottontail for help. What I would advise you do is have two sims searching two separate objects and one sim asking Cottontail for help at the same time therefore saving you time on the quest but also just covering that third option because i'm not sure if it's set to make you need to speak to cottontail which takes the most time yeah asking cottontail for help is going to take 22 hours so i definitely have a sim doing that from the start while the other two search that's really going to help you out time wise once you have all three eggs they're going to appear in your egg hunter's display and the next task is to hug Cottontail. This is probably one of these cutest animations you're about to see. So your sim found the first set of coloured eggs but it wasn't easy. Cottontail looks proud of himself. He seems to be feeling better. Maybe give him a hug to keep up the good feelings. Have a sim hug Cottontail. So for this part of the quest we've just been using this female and we're not gonna like change anything right now we've been able to use her the whole way through so this is really good and she's gonna go ahead and hug cottontail and it's just so so cute i mean it's the same animation cycle and loop but it's a really good one and i absolutely adore this 
So when she finished hugging Cottontail, which I, I think it'd be quite queasy once all that hugging's finished. After the hug, you're going to watch Cottontail. So after the hug, Cottontail said something about getting his bunny legs back. He wants to show your sim. Have a sim watch Cottontail while he starts to use his bunny legs. So once you finish doing that, that part of the task is complete. And then you have unlocked some new snuggly pajamas for your infant and tween sims, which you can find in any wardrobe or when creating a sim. And for the next part of the quest, we need to return in one day and 21 hours. After bouncing around, Cottontail tells your sims that he is sleepy. Come back in one day, 21 hours when Cottontail is done taking a springtime nap. So join me in the next video. Goodbye.